Hey, this is Presh Talwalker, and you're watching Mind Your Decisions. The problem in today's video comes from the American Invitational Mathematics Examination, more commonly called the AMI. The AMI is the second test to qualify for the U.S. Mathematical Olympiad team. It's a three-hour test with 15 questions, and no calculators are allowed. The average score is around 3, which is a mere 20%. It's a hard test even for the talented students who qualify to take it. In this video, I'm going to present problem 14 from the 1987 test. The problem is to evaluate the following fraction. Every answer on the Amy is an integer from 0 to 999 inclusive. I thank Anoop from India for suggesting this problem. Can you figure it out? Give this problem a try, and when you're ready, keep watching the video for a solution. So how can we simplify this fraction? We'll get started by identifying a pattern. Every single parenthetical term in this fraction is of the form x to the power of 4 plus 324. Furthermore, we can factor 324 into 4 times 3 to the power of 4. How can we simplify this? I didn't know this trick, but apparently in mathematical competitions, there's a well-known identity called the Sophie Germain identity. It states that a to the power of 4 plus 4 times b to the power of 4 is equal to the following. It's the product of these two terms. It's a squared plus 2b squared minus 2ab, and the other term is a squared plus 2b squared plus 2ab. So we'll apply this identity to x to the 4 plus 324, and we get the following. We can then simplify this by factoring, and we get the product of the following binomials. We are now going to use this simplification into every single term in the fraction. Let's get started with an example of 10 to the 4 plus 324. Here we have x is equal to 10. So we substitute that into our formula and then simplify it. Now let's take a look at 4 to the power of 4 plus 324. Here we have x is equal to 4, so we simplify it to get the following. So it seems like we haven't actually made things any simpler, we've actually expanded out each term. But there's a cancellation that'll make things simpler. So let's imagine we're just evaluating this fraction. We simplified the numerator and the denominator, and now here's the trick. The first term in the numerator cancels out with the second term in the denominator. So we have this fraction simplify to be just the following fraction. This is going to be a little bit easier to evaluate. Now to get back to our original question, we're going to do a much more involved simplification. So we're going to use the Sophie Germain identity and use the formula presented here to simplify every single term in the numerator and every single term in the denominator. Now let's take a look if there's any cancellation. The first term in the numerator cancels out with the second term in the denominator. Then the second term in the numerator cancels out with the third term in the denominator. And this pattern continues. So we're going to cancel out all of these terms. And it goes all the way until the very end. The only thing that survives is the very last term in the numerator and the very first term in the denominator. This kind of pattern is reminiscent of a retracting telescope, where the only thing that survives is the first thing and the very last thing. So our fraction simplifies to be just the following, and it's an example of a telescoping product. So now we just need to simplify this fraction. Well, that's not too hard. The numerator is equal to 3730, and the denominator is equal to 10. We divide and we get the answer of 373. Thanks for watching. These math videos, which can be watched for free on YouTube, 
build confidence for students, and inspire mathematical discovery for viewers around the world. They have over 100 million views, and the channel has over 1 million subscribers. Please subscribe for free to get the newest videos, and email me a puzzle or math topic, presh at mindyourdecisions.com. If you so choose, you can check out my merchandise on Teespring, you can check out my books, which are listed in the video description, and you can support me on Patreon. Thanks for watching, and thanks for your support.